Welcome to this Python crash course series. So if you're just starting out with Python, the first step is getting it installed, setting it up and making sure that you have a great coding environment for you to work with. So in this video, I'll walk you through installing Python, setting up Visual Studio Code and how you can write your first Python program. And you're going to go to the step by step. So let's get started. Now, the first thing that you need to do when you are installing Python is you need to go to the Python official website and the website is python.org. So once you open this website, you go to the downloads tab and then you download the latest version. So you click on the downloads tab. As you can see here, it will ask you to choose the operating system that you're working with. And then you can download the uh, version of Python for that operating system. Once you've done that, you've downloaded the installer, then you can basically go ahead and, and install it. Follow the, the prompts that you're going to get to install Python in your machine. Once you've done that, the next thing that you can do is you can open up a terminal and try to check the version of Python that you're working with. And to do that, you basically just type in Python space hyphen hyphen version, and then enter, provided you have a version of Python that is 3.10 and above, you should be good to get started. Once you have Python installed, the next thing is to install Visual Studio Code. So to install Visual Studio Code, you go to code.visualstudio.com and if you click on downloads, it's going to give you the options on the kind of, uh, the, how you can download for each of the operating systems that you have. So we have for Debian, for, uh, for uh, RBM, for Ubuntu, for Mac, you can be able to download the version of Visual Studio Code for each of these operating systems. Once you've downloaded it, also follow the installation process to install it fully in your local machine. Then there are also extensions that you can install with Visual, for Visual Studio Code. You can get a Python extension and all the other extensions. Now, the main difference that is going to be here is that in my case, I'm going to be using Z. Uh, Z is another code editor to walk you through the code that you're going to be writing, but it is still similar to Visual Studio Code in terms of the interface. So you should be able to follow everything along smoothly, uh, nothing to be worried about. But Visual Studio Code is good to get started, especially if you are a beginner. So, uh, and that's basically it. So now that you have Python installed and Visual Studio Code uh, set up, we're going to start uh, writing our code in the next video. We dive into the Python basics like variables and data types and operators. And if you found this helpful, please make sure that you like, subscribe and hit the notification bell so that you don't miss the next lesson when it comes in. Uh, so thank you and I'll see you in the next video.